Christmas. My coffee cup this morning is actually a gift from Mixon, but I accidentally saw it probably like two, three weeks ago. But he said I still had to wait until Christmas day to actually use it. So it's just been sitting in the kitchen waiting. Then after Mason wakes up and we do Christmas together here, we'll go do Christmas with family and do like a brunch at 10 o'clock. The problem is Mason could sleep until 10 o'clock or later, even on Christmas day. Last year, I eventually just had to go in there and wake him up. Hey, are you gonna wake up like a normal kid and see what Santa brought you? Or just sleep the day away? But he is such a heavy sleeper. And our activities yesterday already wore him out. So I'm guessing I'm gonna have to wake him up again this year. Does anybody else actually have to wake their kids up on Christmas day? Or are they like most kids, I think, get up crazy early? But do you wanna see what Santa brought before Mason even does? This is what Santa does in our house. I think most year his boots leave this trail. We don't have a chimney, so we put this key outside for him to get in. Of course, he ate his cookies and drank his milk stockings. The norm around here is that mom's is just always empty, you know? And in our house, Santa never wraps gifts. If it's not wrapped, then you know it's from Santa. Besides that cardboard box, mama just didn't have time. Truthfully, I don't know if I've ever worn makeup on Christmas leave at the time, so why not? Although I do feel like it's kind of classic for mom just to be sitting there with her cup of coffee. Just looking like she hasn't slept in 10 days. Let's go wake Mason up. Hey, dude. Hey. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. Are you going to get up? Yeah. Yeah. You need anything? some strawberries we're going to take with us to the next family Christmas thing. But we're running late. we got to go and have a very Merry Christmas. 